Hi everyone, in this video we'll be seeing how to just uh, follow up the mail that you have already sent and also we'll see how to uh, send a mail with a follow up request and without further ado, let's get started. So firstly open your uh, Outlook and let's try with uh, the mail that I have already sent. So let's say in this case uh, I have a mail here which is already sent. If I want to follow up, just uh, move, move to the top right corner and you can see follow up and if you click on today or tomorrow or this week or next week anything you want just click on that uh, if you want to have a custom date uh, just click on that and you can set the reminder on which date you want so this is generally for if you um, forgot uh, something that I have already scheduled a meeting uh, in my case I have uh, sent a mail to a client uh, and I need to expect some reply and the client has forgotten and me as well but manager someday called me and said hey Tej, how what is that and what is the update on that and I was like oh there was some update that I need to get and I was just reminded suddenly and then I look for this option uh, how can I follow up mails and I found this and if you click if you click on ok you can get this follow up reminder and also you can see the flag that is enabled over your mail and you will see, and now we will see how to create a follow up request while you are sending a mail or a meeting invite just click on new email and you can directly see on the right side there is a follow up icon here just click on follow up and set the reminder by which time you want to complete the task so if in my case if it is it was like uh, this week just click on this week and uh, let's say my email and Need your quick action on the prioritized incident. Let's say I have this uh, mail, and if I have sent this mail, uh, it will directly create a follow up and it will try to remind me uh, by the time I mean the due time. Okay, so where you can find your all the uh, actions or follow-up items is uh, you need to go to view and there uh, you can see to do bar just click on the drop down and you can see the task just click on that and you can see that uh, what are all the flags that you have set will be visible here so that's it guys uh, if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon thanks for watching